Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Hope you guys are doing good. In this video, we will discuss the anatomy of the parietal bone. So without wasting any more time, let's get started. Starting with the general information. The parietal bone is a paired bone which forms a part of the cranial roof. This bone is a quadrangular plate with convex external and concave internal surfaces. Let's have a look at this bone. So this bone shaded in the green is the parietal bone and these are the posterior and the superior views of the bone. The parietal bone has four borders and four angles. The borders include the frontal, occipital, sagittal and squamosal border. And the angles include the frontal, occipital, mastoid and sphenoidal angle. We will discuss each of these separately for a better understanding. Starting with the frontal border. The frontal border articulates with the frontal bone. Let's have a look. This is the medial view of the bone and this border outlined in the red is the frontal border. Now let's see the articulation of this border. This is the frontal bone and this is how the frontal border of the parietal bone articulates. Next is the occipital border. The occipital border articulates with the occipital bone. Let's have a look. So this border outlined in the orange is the occipital border. This is the occipital bone. And this is the occipital border of the parietal bone. Next is the sagittal border. The sagittal border articulates with the contralateral bone. Along the internal surface of this border is the groove for the superior sagittal sinus. And there are granular foveolae on either sides of this groove. You may wonder what are granular foveolae. They are nothing but the pits or depressions on the inner wall of the calvarium produced by the arachnoid villi. Calvarium is the upper dome-like portion of the skull. Now let's have a look. So this border outlined in the black is the sagittal border. This is the inferior view of the calvarium. And this green shaded part is the groove for the superior sagittal sinus. As we discussed earlier that there are granular foveolae on either sides of this groove. So these are the pits or the granular foveolae. Last border is the squamosal border. The squamosal border articulates with the temporal bone. Let's have a look. This border outlined in the orange is the squamosal border. This is the temporal bone and this is the squamosal border of the parietal bone. Now let's discuss about the angles. Starting with the frontal angle. The frontal angle unites with the frontal bone. Again, this is the medial view of the bone. This encircled angle is the frontal angle. In this image, you can see the frontal angle. Next is the occipital angle, which unites with the occipital bone. Let's have a look. So this angle outlined in the red is the occipital angle. And this is how it unites with the occipital bone. Next is the mastoid angle. The mastoid angle unites with the mastoid process of the temporal bone. The inner surface of this angle is marked by the groove for sigmoid sinus. Let's have a look. This angle is the mastoid angle. This is the superior view of base of the skull. And this groove shaded in the green is the groove for sigmoid sinus. Last angle is the sphenoidal angle. The sphenoidal angle is narrow and it unites with the sphenoid bone. This is the sphenoidal angle. Now let's discuss about the features of the external surface. In the center of the external surface, there is parietal tuber, also called as the parietal tuberosity and parietal eminence. Below this parietal tuber, there are two curved temporal lines. Let's have a look. So this is the lateral view of the skull. And this region shaded in the red is the parietal tuber. These two curved lines are the superior and the inferior temporal lines. 
One of the important feature of the internal surface is that it is marked by the groove for middle meningeal artery. Let's have a look. This is the groove for the middle meningeal artery. With this we complete the anatomy of the parietal bone. So that is it for this video guys. Don't forget to subscribe the channel and follow us on Instagram. Links in the description.